Steam engines reached their peak in the 1930s, a great decade for architecture, song lyrics, literature, and industrial design. Among the great designs of those days were streamlined steam locomotives. In order to compete with airplanes and cars, the railroads hired famous industrial designers like Raymond Lowy and Henry Dreyfus to create futuristic looking steam locomotives. The result was a series of spectacular, colorful designs that are as stunning today as they were 60 years ago. Some of the most famous streamlined steamers are the New York Central's Empire State Express, the Dreyfus Hudson, which many feel is the most beautiful steam locomotive ever designed. In the first streamlined steamer, the Commodore Vanderbilt, which debuted in 1934. The Milwaukee Road was mighty proud of their Hiawatha that roared along the Mississippi River on its way to St. Paul, Minnesota. The Union Pacific's handsome 49er provided deluxe passenger service to San Francisco. Raymond Lowy must have used a rocket ship as a model when he designed the Pennsylvania Railroad's torpedo. They're all handsome, but my favorite is the Southern Pacific's black, silver, orange, and red 484 Daylight. What a beautiful sight this engine must have made in the 1940s as it roared along the Pacific Ocean between LA and San Francisco. These gorgeous streamlined steamers were beautiful to watch, but sadly, they were doomed. The more powerful, cheaper to maintain diesels would soon come along and replace steam power. But the streamlined era was sure nice while it lasted. Save the railway train. 
was a day when it looked like the rails would die away. Other machines would go farther and faster, and the steamer trains were headed for disaster. But men with steel in their veins vowed to save the railway trains. They worked day and night, and when they were done, a new era had just begun. People stared. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just click the subscribe button. You'll know every time we upload a new segment.